Well, a traumatic event two years ago this month altered an Oregon woman's life forever. But she is taking what happened to her and using it as a way to advocate for others. In tonight's Positive Vibes, I introduce you to Miss Wheelchair Oregon as she recruits people for the next pageant. Melinda Preciado is the reigning Miss Wheelchair Oregon, a pageant she was unfamiliar with until two years ago when her life was forever changed after what she calls a traumatic event. I did almost lose um, my right arm and both legs, luckily just above the knee on my right. As an amputee, Melinda says it was a struggle to lose that bit of independence and have to rely on a wheelchair. Well, then a friend told her about the Miss Wheelchair pageant. Yeah, I mean, I'm going through a lot in you know, my early 40s. Wasn't quite sure um, where it will take me, but it ended up taking me this way a lot faster than what I thought it would. Within a year, she was crowned Miss Wheelchair Oregon. Melinda says it's not like pageants people may be familiar with. For instance, there's no talent or swimsuit portion. It's not like some like just beauty pageant. It's like so much more than that. It's advocacy, education and empowerment. The advocacy part is what attracted Melinda the most. She'd already been advocating for her son who has autism his whole life. So you get to choose your platform. It could be about whatever illness someone might have or I mean, it's all up to you, whatever you're passionate about. Her platform is Adapting America for All. She's been working with elected officials to make the world more accessible to those who are alter abled. The Oregon pageant has been sporadic since 1980. Melinda is only the fourth Miss Wheelchair Oregon. She's hoping that by raising awareness, more people will apply. And when I went to nationals and really got to see all these other amazing women around me that, of course, all our stories or journeys are different. It just really was beyond magical Well, again, Melinda says they are looking for more participants for the 2023 Miss Wheelchair Oregon pageant, which is coming up in March. And you do have to be 21 years old or older to participate. We have a link on coin.com if you or anyone you know is interested. See, I'd never even heard of this I was just going to say, before. I'd never heard of it before yeah. either. So it's great to get the word out about yeah. what she's doing to empower people. She went through all of that and like a year late. It was just crazy what she's wow. been through. And, and now, you know, you never know where life's going to take you, I you guess. Don't. Yeah. Mm -hmm. All right, let's talk about the